Nissan Skyline The Nissan Skyline is a line of compact cars, sports cars and compact executive cars originally produced by the Prince Motor Company starting in 1955, and then by Nissan after the two companies merged in 1966. After the merger, the Skyline and its larger counterpart, the Nissan Gloria, were sold in Japan at dealership sales channels called Nissan Prince Shop. The Skyline was largely designed and engineered by Shinichiro Sakurai from inception, and he remained a chief influence of the car until his death in 2011. Skylines are available in either coupe, or sedan body styles, plus station wagon, crossover, convertible and pickup delivery van body styles. The later models are most commonly known by their trademark round brake and tail lights, as of 1972 while not distributed in the United States until its importation as the Infinity G, the Skyline's prominence in video games, movies and magazines resulted in many such cars being imported there from 1999 to late 2005 via Motorex. Majority of Skyline models are rear-wheel drive, with four-wheel drive being available since the 8th generation's debut. The 11th generation Skyline, V35 was another major turning point for the nameplate, as it dropped some of the previous generation Skyline's trademark characteristics such as the straight six engine, replaced with a V6, and turbocharging, and eventually separated the GTR into its own line. Nissan decided to retain the Skyline for the luxury sport market, while its platform mate, the 350Z, revived the Z line of pure sports cars. The V35 was the first Skyline made for export to North America, being sold under Nissan's luxury mark Infinity as the G35. The Skyline, V36 per Dual 50, is sold in Europe, North America, South Korea, Taiwan, and the Middle East as the Infinity G37. On April 11, 2010 a Guinness Book of Records event took part with 225 Skylines taking part in a parade lap at the ISTS at Silverstone UK this produced two world records the first being the most recorded Nissan Skylines at one meet at one time and another being the most Nissan Skylines on a track at the same time. Prince Skyline ALS ID 1 slash ALS ID 2 slash BLRA 3 ALS ID 1 The first Skyline was introduced in April 1957, by the Prince Motor Company, and was marketed as a luxury car. It featured a 1.5L, 1,482 cc, GA30 engine producing 44 kilowatts, 60 horsepower, at 4,400 rpms. It used a Dion tube rear suspension and was capable of 140 km per hour. 87 miles per hour. The car weighed around 1,300 kilograms. Prince Skylines were produced as four-door sedans and five-door station wagons. Its appearance seems to be influenced by a popular luxury car during the same time period, called the Oldsmobile 88. Reflecting popular appearances found in North America, the Skyline used a styling feature on the front bumper, called Dagmar bumpers. The Skyline also spawned a pickup truck and a delivery van marketed as the Prince Skyway. ALS ID 2 The Skyline was updated with quad headlights for 1958. It was again facelifted in February 1960. This model was powered by a slightly altered 1.5-liter OHV engine known as the GA4, 1,484 cc's, producing about 70 picoseconds, 51 kilowatts, at 4,800 rpms and was produced through 193. A 1,862 cc engine was also available in the Skyline 1900, BLS ID 3 slash BLS IS 3, delivering 91 picoseconds, 67 kilowatts, at 4,800 rpms. This version was introduced in May 1961 and continued in production until the introduction of the second generation Skyline in 1963 and 1962. This model was restyled as the S21 DS series. BLRA 3R21 Aries per byte. The Skyline Sport featured hand-built Michelotti bodies in stylish coupe, R21A, 
and convertible, R21B, versions. These cars used the 1.9L, 1862cc-113 cubic inches, GB30 engine, producing 96 horsepower, 72 kilowatts, and 113.5 feet by pound force, 154 newton meters. While only a few hundred were built, Prince Motors had a very aggressive product placement group and they can be seen, along the company's mainstream models, in many Toho films of the early 1960s. S50 per seconds 54 per seconds 57 S50 In 1961 Fuji Precision Industries changed its name to Prince after the 1954 merger. Two years later, in September 1963, the S50 Skyline Deluxe Series was launched. Like its predecessor, it came in sedan and wagon body styles. This was the second generation car, and became one of the more desirable cars in Japan. It was powered by the G1 engine, a 70 picoseconds, 51 kilowatts, version of the old GA4. The S50 series were available with a 3-speed column shift transmission, or a 4-speed floor shift transmission from February 1965, deluxe only either as a 4-door sedan, S50, or a 5-door wagon, W50. A two-speed automatic option was added to the Deluxe in June 1966. The lower-priced and equipped standard model was added in April 1964. Aiming at taxi operators and others it also lacked bumper overriders, making it 11 cm shorter. Two main models of the S50 were built, the S50, 1963-1966, and the lightly facelifted S50-2. 1966 to 1967. These all used the same engine, with the later S57 receiving a more modern unit. Externally, this generation was installed with rounded brake lights and integrated tail lights, with a centrally installed turn signal, similar in appearance to the Ford Galaxy of 1960. The significant appearance change from the previous generation seems to reflect a similar approach done by German company BMW in 1962, in deciding to build a small, affordable, performance coupe and sedan. The S50 was sold in some markets with an A150 designation. In European markets, and other export markets, it was also marketed as the PMC Mikado A150. The S50 was also sold as the A190D, which was equipped with a 55 picoseconds, 40 kilowatts, 1.9 liter diesel engine. This model had sparse equipment, including a simplified, pressed steel grille. In Europe, period testers commented on the car's compact size, more like a 1.0 than a 1.5 and its sprightly performance, in large part due to the extremely low gearing. The car's ample lighting was also noted, offering twin headlights, a bevy of warning lamps, numerous engine room light fittings, etc. Also lauded were the car's road manners, as evident by the six-cylinder Skyline's competition successes. In 1966, Nissan and Prince merged and the S50 also appeared with Nissan Prince Skyline badging. This model lasted in production through 1967. In October 1966, the S50-2 was introduced. This light facelift included a new grille and tail lights, as well as changes to the interior, and with the addition of an extraction vent on the C-pillar. It was sold as Prince Skyline, Prince A150, PMC A150, or Nissan A150, depending on the market. All Prince dealership locations were added to the existing Nissan Datsun Japanese dealerships while retaining the Prince name to become Nissan Prince Store. S54 Prince created a racing GT Skyline in May 1964. It was based on the S54 and used the larger six-cylinder G7 engine from the Gloria S41, though the car needed a 200mm extension to the wheelbase, all forward of the cowl firewall, to provide space in the engine bay for the Lankier in Line 6. When it entered the second Japanese Grand Prix they hoped to win the GTI class. Competitive against the Porsche 904, the Skyline managed second through to sixth places. 
largely due to the success of the race vehicle, the Prince Skyline 2000 GT, also called GTA, GTB, S54A and S54B, was released to the Japanese market. There were two versions produced. S54A, 1988cc G7 single car by 6, 105 picoseconds, 77 kilowatts, S54B, 1988cc G7 triple car by 6, 125 picoseconds, 92 kilowatts, at 5,600 rpms. The B model featured three Weber 40 DCOE 18 carburetors, a limited slip differential, five speed close ratio manual transmission, and power brakes. Both the B and A used front disc brakes with dual pistons and alloy fin drums in the rear. S57 The S50 Skyline was updated to become the S57 in August 1967. It used a new engine of Prince's, designed before the merger with Nissan, the OHC 1.5L, 1483cc, G15. At 88 picoseconds, 65 kilowatts, it was the most powerful engine in the Japanese 1500cc class. C10 the C10 series of 1968, which began its development under Prince at the company's Ogakubo R&D Center in the suburbs of Tokyo, was marketed with a Nissan badge. By the time the C10 went on sale, the Prince nameplate had been completely phased out on cars and trucks. The dealer network selling the cars became the Prince channel of Nissan, and the marketing group stayed at the Prince headquarters in Mito instead of moving to Nissan's headquarters in Ginza. The C10 Skyline was launched with Prince's 1.5L OHC G15i4 like the S57. A 1.8L G18 version was also available. A station wagon variant, known previously as the Prince Skyway, was offered with this generation. A hardtop coupe was introduced in October 1970. The brake and tail lights were modified to square units but now included dual units for both the left and right side of the vehicle. 2000 GTX In 1971, the KGC-10 2000 GTX received a 2.0L, 1998cc, L20 straight 6 engine instead of the Prince G7 engine. The chassis was already designed to fit a straight 6, to avoid the S54 extension problem. 120 picoseconds, 88 kilowatts, was available from this new engine. In March 1972 expanded the lineup to include a four-door GTX sedan. 2000 GT The following year, the GC10 2000 GT received a 2.0L, 1998cc, L20i6 engine like the Nissan Cedric instead of a Prince G7 engine. The chassis was already designed to receive a straight 6, to avoid the S54 extension problem. 105 horsepower, 78 kilowatts, was available from this new engine. In 1970 Nissan production Skyline 2000 GT Automatic, in October 1970 Nissan introduced two-door coupe. GTR The first GTR Skyline appeared in February 1969. Called the PGC-10, KPGC-10 for later coupe version, internally and Hakozuka, Hakozuka, by fans. Hako, Hako, means box in Japanese, and Suka, Suka, is short for Skyline, Sukera Rain. Sukera Rain. It used the 2.0L, 1998cc, S20i6. This new DOHC engine, which was designed by the former Prince engineers, produced 160 horsepower, 118 kilowatts, 180 Nm, and was similar to the GR8 engine used in the Prince R380 racing car. The GTR began as a sedan, but a two-door coupe version was debuted in October 1970 and introduced in March 1971. The cars were stripped of unnecessary equipment to be as light as possible for racing, and performed well at the track. The sedan racked up 33 victories in less than two years, and the coupe stretched this to 50 through 1972. 
the C10 raced against many cars including the Toyota Corona 1600 GT, RT55, Isuzu Bellet GTR, Mazda Familia, R100, and Capella, RX2, even Porsche. In late 1971 the new Mazda RX-3 became the GTR's main rival. The GTR managed a few more victories before the RX-3 ended the GTR's winning streak. Models 1500-1.5 LG 15i4, 88 horsepower, 71 kilowatts, 128 Nm, 1500-1.5 LG 15i4, 95 horsepower, 71 kilowatts, 128 Nm, 1800-1.8 LG 18i4, 105 horsepower, 78 kilowatts, 150 Nm, 2000 GT, 2.0 LL 20i6, 120 horsepower, 90 kilowatts, 167 Nm, 2000 GTR, 2.0 LS 20i6, 160 horsepower, 118 kilowatts, 180 Nm. Body styles. C10 four door sedan or five door wagon 1968. GC10 four door 2000 GT 1969. PGC10 four door GTA Skyline 1969. KPGC10 two door GTA Skyline 1970. KGC10 2000 GTX two door 1971. KGC 10 2000 GTX 4 door 1972, HGLC 10 2000 2400 GT 4 door left hand drive. C110 The C110 generation was produced from 1972 through 1977. For export in the 1970s, the C110 and GC110 Skyline was sold as the Datsun K series with models such as the Datsun 160K, 180K and Datsun 240K. The body styles were, once again, four-door sedan, two-door hardtop coupe, and five-door station wagon. The C110 was more fussy in its styling than its predecessor, particularly so in wagon form, where unusually for a wagon design, no windows were fitted between the C and D pillars. Its appearance seems to be influenced by the 1970-1975 Citroen SM. The C110 was the first version to return to the round rear tail and brake lights introduced in 1963 albeit with dual units from the previous generation, and the appearance has become a traditional skyline feature. The styling also influenced a smaller, more affordable two-door coupe, called the Silvia, introduced in 1975. Nissan introduced its emission control technology, primarily consisting of fuel injection on trim packages ending with an E, using the moniker Nissan Naps also in 1975. The C110 Skyline was better known as the Ken and Mary, or Ken Mary, Ken Mary, Skyline, stemming from the advertisement campaign in Japan at the time which featured a young couple, Ken and Mary, who relaxed and enjoyed the countryside in Ken and Mary's Skyline. Kento Marinozuke Rain. The ads were highly successful and perhaps as a result the C110 was sold in very large numbers in Japan. It sold just as well in Australia, in a 2.4L six-cylinder form, badged as Datsun 240K, though few survive today. There, the 240K was about the same price as a Ford Falcon GT or BMW 5 Series, around $5,000. GTR. The Nissan Skyline GTR hardtop arrived in September 1972 but only lasted until March 1973, when Nissan ceased its production. The oil crisis saw many people preferring economy cars and high-performance sports cars were looked down upon. Nissan pulled out of motor racing, so there was no purpose to the GTR. It was not officially exported anywhere, although Nissan contemplated exporting to Australia. Only 197 KPGC 110 GTRS were ever sold in Japan, through specialist Nissan performance shops, before it was called NISMO. This was the last GTR for 16 years until the BNR32 in 1989. Models 1600 1.6 LG 16 i4, 1800 1.8 LG 18 i4, 2000 GTX. 
2.0 LL20 AI6, 130 horsepower, 96 kilowatts, 172 Nm, 2000 GTR, 2.0 LS20 I6, 160 horsepower, 118 kilowatts, 180 Nm. C210 the succeeding C210-211 and GC210-211 of 1977 continued to split the Skyline range into basic and six-cylinder models, the latter with a longer wheelbase and front end. This line continued through 1981. A rare variant would be the wagon version, which had a unique styling treatment behind the rear doors, of a much smaller window than usual between the C and D pillars. The Skyline received an internal and external facelift in late 1978, which led to a change of the model code from 210 to 211. This was also when the Skyline first appeared in several European export markets, such as Germany. The GTX replaced the discontinued GTL with a turbocharged engine, the L20ET. As installed in the recently renewed Nissan Cedric Gloria, this had been the first turbo engine to power a Japanese production vehicle. One notable aspect of the turbo versions was that they were not intercooled and there was no form of blow-off valve, only an emergency pressure release valve. As usual with Japanese cars of this period, there were four or five speed manuals and a three-speed automatic, with a column-shifted three-speed manual available on lower-end cars and vans. The T designation on the L16T and L18T does not signify a turbocharger was included. It denotes that those engines came with twin carburetors. The L series engines were all switched to the Crossflow Z series in late 1978. The larger 2.4 liter inline 6 was never offered in the domestic Japanese market, having been reserved for export. Export engines were rated and in horsepower. So while a Japanese spec L24 promised 130 ponies, European market cars with the same engine only claimed 113 picoseconds, 83 kilowatts. On the other hand, European buyers could also get the fuel-injected L24E with 127 or 130 picoseconds, 93 or 96 kilowatts, DIN, about on par with what the turbocharged GTX offered. Originally marketed as the Datsun 240K GT in Europe, the fuel-injected version was sold as the Datsun Skyline in most markets where it was available. It has a claimed top speed of 186 km per hour, 116 miles per hour. In June 1980 the 2.0-litre, fuel-injected inline 4Z20E engine was added to the lineup, as was the 2.8-litre straight-six GT diesel with 91 picoseconds. 67 kilowatts models 1600 ti 1.6 lz 16i4 95 picoseconds 70 kilowatts 13.5 kilograms by meter 132 newtons by meter 1800 ti 1.8 lz 18i4 105 picoseconds 77 kilowatts 15.0 kilograms by meter 147 newtons by meter, the similar L18 received a claimed 77 picoseconds, 57 kilowatts, DIN in European export markets, 1800 TIEL, 1.8 LZ18 EI4, 115 picoseconds, 85 kilowatts, 15.5 kilograms by meter, 152 newtons by meter, 2000 GTEL. 2.0 LL20 EI6, 130 picoseconds, 96 kilowatts, 17.0 kilograms by meter, 167 newtons by meter, 2000 GTX, 2.0 LL20 ET Turbo I6, 145 picoseconds, 107 kilowatts, 21.0 kilograms by meter, 206 newtons by meter. Datsun 240K GT, 2.4 LL24i6, 113 picoseconds, 83 kilowatts, DIN, 18.0 kilograms by meter, 177 newtons by meter, 180 kilometers per hour, 110 miles per hour, 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in 13.5 S.
R30. The names were brought into line with the home Japanese and worldwide markets with the launch of the R30 series in August 1981, which was built on a C31 Laurel platform. Unlike preceding generations, four- and six-cylinder versions now shared a front end of the same length. The R30 was available as a two-door hardtop coupe, a four-door sedan, a five-door hatchback, available only in the R30 generation, or a four-door station wagon. In all, there were 26 variations of the R30 Skyline available. All versions with the exception of the wagon were usually fitted with the four round tail lights that had become a regular feature to the Skyline's design. The wagon had different tail lights, headlights, and no turbo or six-cylinder versions available. It more closely resembled a Nissan Sunny than a Skyline. The two-door coupe had a hard top, pillarless design, and featured roll-down quarter windows for the rear seat passengers, a styling feature of the previous C10, C110, and C211 coupes, while four-door versions had a traditional sedan body style with framed windows. Notably, configurations of the R30 sold in Australia and New Zealand were missing the traditional hot plate tail lights, instead opting for more conventional styling. Export markets also received some larger, albeit less powerful, engines, in the form of 2.4 under 2.8 litre inline sixes of 120 picoseconds, 88 kilowatts, or 139 picoseconds, 102 kilowatts. The 2.8 was added in September 1982. Various engine configurations were available initially ranging from the top-of-the-line 103 kW SOHC six-cylinder turbo L20 ET to the four-cylinder Z18S and six-cylinder LD28 diesel versions at the other end of the scale. The all-new 16-valve DOHC FJ20 engine debuted in late 1981, and was the first four-cylinder engine from any Japanese manufacturer to employ more than two valves per cylinder, see below. Some of the top spec models featured adjustable suspension dampers that could be adjusted while driving, this was another first for mass produced JDM vehicles. Nissan Glorias and Laurels also used the L series engines, as well as some diesel, Laurel only, variants. The A30 range was facelifted in August 1983 with various changes across the board. For example, four wheel disc brakes were now standard issue instead of being optional for lower spec models. Trim specifications were revised and the four-cylinder Z18S engine was replaced with the newer CA18E. Features included upgraded interior trim, new front and rear bumpers, door-mounted wing mirrors, replacing the old hockey stick fender mirrors, and smoke tail lights. Paul Newman version during 1983 the Paul Newman version of 30 was released to commemorate the association between Nissan and the actor Paul Newman, who used to appear in promotional material, as well as race for the company during the late 1970s and early 1980s. The Newman Skyline was simply a top-spec GTES turbo with signature embroidery and decals. Although making about the same power as the L20 ET powered GTES models, the version of the Skyline initially known as the 2000 RS was released on October 2, 1981 as more of a stripped-down lightweight razor, without as many luxury extras included, quoted curb weight was only 1,130 kg, 2,490 pounds. These were equipped with the naturally aspirated four-valve per cylinder DOHC FJ20E engine generating 110 kW, 150 picoseconds. 148 horsepower, of power at 6,000 rpms and 181 newtons by meter, 133 pounds by foot, of torque at 4,800 rpms. The official Nissan chassis designation for all FJ20 powered models was DR30. In February 1983 the DR30 range received a significant boost in performance with the introduction of the turbocharged FJ20 ET engine in the 2000 RS Turbo. Front brakes were also significantly upgraded to cope with a power increase. Now with 140 kilowatts, 190 picoseconds, 188 horsepower, of power at 6,400 rpms and 225 newtons by meter, 
166 pounds by foot, of torque at 4,800 rpms on tap, the FJ-20 ET enjoyed newfound prestige as the most powerful Japanese production engine of its era. Nissan sought to elevate the status of the DF-30 Skyline as their new flagship model in light of this success, and it received a generous amount of changes to distinguish it from lesser Skyline models in August 1983. Interior equipment was significantly upgraded to now include electric windows, air conditioning and power steering as standard in the new RSX model, for extra, with an increased curb weight of around 1,235 kg, 2,723 pounds. Gone were the days of the Spartan, stripped-up race interior, although this could still be specified at time of purchase. But by far the most striking change to the RS was the new unique front-end treatment, nicknamed Takaman, Tai Jiao Mian, or Iron Mask by fans for its distinctive look. The headlights were considerably slimmer, and instead of a conventional grille the bonnet now sloped down to two narrow slit above a facelifted front bumper and aired them. Further changes were made in 1984, most notably the addition of an intercooler. Revised compression ratios and turbocharger exhaust housing to the FJ20 ET powered model, now known as the RS Turbo C, and increasing output to 205 picoseconds, 151 kilowatts, of power at 6,400 rpms and 245 newtons by meter, 181 pounds by foot, of torque at 4,400 rpms. An automatic transmission option was also added at this time and changes to the plasma spark ignition system followed in early 1985 towards the end of R30 production. To this day the FJ20 powered R30 Skyline remains a cult car both at home and overseas, there are still dedicated one-make drag racing events for this model in Japan, and is credited with rejuvenating the Skyline brand in the early 1980s. It also paved the way for the eventual reintroduction of the legendary GTR badge, markedly absent since the end of C-110 Skyline production in 1973. The RS achieved moderate success in Australian touring car racing in the mid-1980s with Nissan winning the 1986 Australian Manufacturers' Championship and sharing victory in the 1987 Australian Manufacturers' Championship with BMW. Models, Japan 1800Ti 1.8 LZ18 SSOHCI4, 105 picoseconds, 77 kilowatts. Later models 1.8 LCA18 ESOHCI4, 115 picoseconds, 85 kilowatts. 2000 Ti, 2.0 LCA20 ESOHCI4, 2000 Ti, 2.0 LZ20 ESOHCI4, 2000 GT in passage. 2.0 LL20 ESOHCI6, 2000 GT Turbo, Passage and Paul Newman version, 2.0 LL20 ET Turbo I6, 140 picoseconds, 103 kilowatts, 206 Nm, RS, 2.0 LFJ20 EDOHCI4, 150 picoseconds, 110 kilowatts, 181 Nm. RSX and RSX Turbo C, 2.0 LFJ20 ET DOHC Turbo I4, 190 to 205 picoseconds, 140 to 151 kilowatts, 225 to 245 Nm, 280D GT, 2.8 LLD28 SOHCI6 diesel. R31 the R31 Skyline of 1986 was a natural evolution on the R30 shape, and also this one was loosely based on the Laurel platform, C32. The design was slightly larger and squarer than previous Skylines. It was available as a sedan, hardtop sedan, coupe and station wagon. Affectionately known as the 7th SU, or simply 7th SU Care Rain by owners, due to it being the 7th generation Skyline. The R31 Skyline introduced many new technologies and features. The HR31 was the first Skyline to be equipped with a newer B series of engines. The R31 B engines are often referred to as red top engines because of the red cam covers. There were three variants. The earliest series of DOHCRB engines used the NICS, 
Nissan induction control system, injection system with 12 very small intake runners, and a butterfly system to divide the intake ports in half for better lower PM performance. Later versions use DCCS, electronically concentrated control system, engine management, discarded the 12 tiny runners for 6 much larger ones, though they retained 12 ports on the head, so there was a splitter plate, and received a slightly larger turbocharger. Nissan's RD28, a 2.8 straight 6 engine, featured for a diesel option. Another technological first for the R31 was the introduction of Nissan's proprietary four-wheel steering system, dubbed HICAS, High Capacity Active Steering. The R31 series were also the only models in the Skyline family to feature a four-door hardtop variation. These models were generally badged as the Passage GT. The R31 Skyline was also produced in Australia, with a 3.0L motor, a B30E available in sedan or wagon form, as well as a four-cylinder version called the Nissan Pintara. The wagon had the same front style as the coupe and sedan, the only difference being that it lacked the four round brake lights that had been a consistent element of Skyline design, except for the A31 Series 1-2 which had rectangular tail lights with a solid bar through the center which was also shared by the Pintara. These cars were manufactured in Australia due to the heavy import laws which made it expensive to bring cars into Australia. 29,305 R31 Skylines were also manufactured and sold in South Africa in four-door sedan form between 1987 and 1992. These were the last Skylines seen in South Africa. Power came from either the RB30E 3.0 straight six motor, RB20 E 2.0 straight six motor or the CA20 S four cylinder power plant. GTSR. The ultimate version of the R31 was the RB20 DETR powered HR31 GTSR coupe of which 800 units were built to allow homologation for group or touring car racing. It had a reworked version of the normal RB20 DET with a much larger turbocharger on a tubular steel exhaust manifold, as well as a much larger front mounted intercooler boosting power to a factory claimed 210 picoseconds, 154 kilowatts, with racing versions making over 430 horsepower, 321 kilowatts, in Group A trim. Models Japan 1800C, 1800 Excel and 1800 Passage, 1.8 LCA 18 SSOHCI4, 90 horsepower, 66 kilowatts, GT XLD, GT Passage D, 2.8 L Diesel Road 28 SOHCI6, 92 horsepower, 68 kilowatts, 173 Nm, GT XL, GT Passage, 2.0 LRB20 ESOHCI6, 128 horsepower, 96 kilowatts, GT XL Twin Cam 24V, GT Passage Twin Cam 24V, 2.0 LRB20 DEDOHC16, 155 horsepower, 114 kilowatts, GT Passage Turbo, 2.0 LRB20 ETSOHC Turbo I6, 167 horsepower, 125 kilowatts, 206 Nm, GT Passage Twin Cam 24V Turbo, 2.0 LRB20 DET DOHC Turbo I6, 180 horsepower, 133 kilowatts, 225 Nm, GTS, 2.0 LRB20 DEDOHC 16, 155 horsepower, 114 kilowatts, GTS Turbo, 2.0 LRB20 DET DOHC 16, 180 horsepower, 133 kilowatts, 225 Nm, GTS X, 2.0 LRB20 DET DOHC Turbo I6, 190 horsepower, 141 kilowatts, 240 Nm, GTSR. 2.0 LRB20 DETR DOHC Turbo I6, 210 horsepower, 154 kilowatts, 245 Nm, GTS Otec, 2.0 LRB20 DETR DOHC Turbo I6, 210 horsepower, 
154 kilowatts, 245 Nm. Australia. Pantara, 2.0 LCA 20 EI4, 102 horsepower, 78 kilowatts, 160 Nm. GX, Executive, GXE, Silhouette, T, 3.0 LRB30 ESOHCI6, 157 horsepower, 117 kilowatts, 252 Nm. Silhouette GTS 1-3.0 LRB30 ESOHCI6, 176 horsepower, 130 kilowatts, 255 Nm. Silhouette GTS 2-3.0 LRB30 ESOHCI6, 190 horsepower, 140 kilowatts, 270 Nm. South Africa. 2.0 gallons, 2.0 GLE. 2.0 LCA 20 SI4, 106 horsepower, 78 kilowatts, 163 Nm, 2.0 SGLI, 2.0 LRB20 ESOHCI6, 115 horsepower, 85 kilowatts, 174 Nm, 3.0 SGLI, 3.0 LRB30 ESOHCI6, 171 horsepower, 126 kilowatts, 260 Nm. R32 The R32 Skyline debuted in May 1989. It was available as either a two-door coupe or four-door hardtop sedan, all other body styles were dropped. The R32 featured several versions of the RB series straight-six engines, which had improved heads, the 12-port inlet was gone, and used the ECCS electronically concentrated control system, injection system. Also available was an 1800cc four-cylinder GXI model. Most models had HICAS four-wheel steering, with the rear wheels being hydraulically linked to the front steering. The 2.5-litre GTS 25 became one of the first Japanese production cars to feature a five-speed automatic transmission. The GTST came in standard and Type M configurations, with the Type M having larger 5 stud 16 inch wheels, 4 piston front calipers, and twin piston rears, plus other minor differences. ABS was optional, except for the GTR and GTS4. Mechanical LSD was standard on the GTR, and viscous LSD was standard on all turbo models and optional on all but the GXI. Nissan also produced 100 Australian models of the R32. In addition, there was a 4WD version of the GTST Type M, called the GTS4. The station wagon body style was spun off as the Nissan Avenir. Models GXI Type X, 1.8 LCA 18 i 4 91 horsepower, 67 kilowatts. GTE Type X, 2.0 LRB20 EI6, 125 horsepower, 93 kilowatts. 152 Nm, GTS Type X, S, J, 2.0 LRB20 Di6 155 horsepower, 115 kilowatts, 154 Nm, GTS 25 Type X, S, XG, 2.5 LRB25 Di6, 180 horsepower, 134 kilowatts, 231 Nm, GTST, Type M, 2.0 LRB20 DET Turbo I6, 212 horsepower, 158 kilowatts, 265 Nm. GTS 4 2.0 LRB20 DET Turbo I6, 212 horsepower, 158 kilowatts, 265 Nm. 4WD. OTEC GTS 4 2.6 LRB26 DI6. 217 horsepower, 162 kilowatts. Autech version, auto only, 4WD, only 188 made. GTR, 2.6 LRB26 DETT twin turbo i6, 276 horsepower, 280 picoseconds, 206 kilowatts, 368 Nm, 4WD. Also NISMO, N1, V spec and V-Spec 2 variants, Nismo S-Tune. GTR 
the RB26 DETT engine actually produced 320 picoseconds, but it was unstated due to the Japanese carmaker's gentleman's agreement not to exceed 280 picoseconds, 276 horsepower. The engine was designed for 500 horsepower in racing trim, and then muzzled by the exhaust, boost restriction, and ECU. The electronic boost control had a small physical restriction in the controller lines. It was marked in yellow so the new owner could remove it and enjoy a safe factory boost increase. After this increase the car would put out 310 horsepower, 230 kilowatts, and could do 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in 4.7 seconds and quarter mile in 12.8 seconds. The GTR had a significantly larger intercooler, larger brakes, and aluminium front guards and bonnet. Other distinguishing features include flared front and rear wheel arches. More supportive seats were fitted, and the turbo boost gauge and digital clock were removed from inside the instrument cluster. The clock was replaced with a torque meter that indicated how much torque was being delivered to the front wheels, 0%-50%. Oil temp, voltage, and turbo boost gauges were fitted just above the climate control. The Porsche 959 was Nissan's target when designing the GTR. The chief engineer, Naganari Ito, intended to use the car for Group A racing, so the design specification was drawn up in conjunction with a copy of the Group A rules. The Nordliff production car record at the time of development was 845 inches set by a Porsche 944. Nissan test driver Hiroyoshi Kato reset the record with a time of 820 inches. Best motoring managed 822 inches 38. The A32 GTR dominated Japanese Touring Car Championship, JTCC, winning 29 races from 29 starts, taking the series title every year from 1989 to 1993. It took 50 races from 50 starts from 1991 to 1997, latterly A33, in the N1 Super Tegu. The A32 GTR was introduced into the Australian Touring Car Championship in 1990 and promptly ended the reign of the previously all-conquering Ford Sierra Cosworth, winning Bathurst 1000 Classic in 1991 and 1992. This success led to the Australian motoring press nicknaming the car Godzilla due to it being a monster from Japan. As Australia was the first export market for the car the name quickly spread. Such was GTR's dominance that it was a significant factor in the demise of Group A touring car racing, the formula being scrapped soon after. JTCC was similarly blighted by the A32 GTR, and splintered soon after, leading to the switch to the Super Touring category and also indirectly to the GT500 category of today. When originally designed, the homologation rulebook mandated 16 inch wheels, so that's what the GTR got. This limited the size of the brakes, and the Nissan 4 pots weren't really up to competition use. A later change in rules allowed 17 inch wheels, so in February 1993 the GTR V Spec, for victory, emerged wearing 17 inches BBS mesh wheels, 225 slash 50 slash 17, covering larger Brembo brakes. The clutch actuation changed from a push to a pull system, the car had the standard rear differential. The electronic rear differential did not show up until the A33 VSPEC. A year later the V-Spec 2 appeared with a new sticker and wider tires, 245-4517. The Nismo Skyline GTR is a limited, 500 street, 60 racing, version of Nissan Skyline with Nissan AB engine with twin ceramic turbochargers rated 280 picoseconds, 206 kilowatts. 276 horsepower, at 6,800 rpms and 353 newtons by meter, 260 pounds by foot, at 4,400 rpms, all-wheel steering, electronically controlled four-wheel drive. The Nismo Skyline GTR is eligible for U.S. import under the NHTSA show or display rule. That allows vehicles with historical or technological significance to be imported even though they do not comply with federal motor vehicle safety standards. R33 The R33 Skyline was introduced in August 1993. 
slightly heavier than the F-32, it is available in coupe and sedan body styles. All models now used a six-cylinder engine. Nissan took the unusual step of downgrading the GTS model to have only the RB20E, while the twin cam of the R32 GTS was discontinued along with the 2.0L turbo RB20DET. Some models came equipped with a new version of the HICAS four-wheel steering system called Super HICAS. This computer-controlled system was first used on the R32 GTR. Super HICAS used electric actuators to steer the rear, as opposed to the hydraulic HICAS. This generation was no longer considered a compact under Japanese legislation that determined the amount of tax liability based on exterior dimensions. As an option, an active limited slip differential was available instead of the standard viscous LSD. This new unit locked the rear differential if it detected that traction was lost by one of the wheels. A light on the dash also lit up if the LSD engaged. Active LSD came standard on all V-Spec R33 GTS Skylines and was also available on some EC R33 GTS 25T models. These can be identified by the ALSD and slip lights on the tachometer. The RB25D and RB25DET engines also became equipped with NVCS, variable inlet cam phasing. NVCS equipped RBs have a bulge on the front of the cam cover. To celebrate their 40th anniversary, Nissan introduced a very rare four-door GTR. Two versions of the four-door GTR were available from Nissan subsidiaries, the first was produced by Otec, and the second was a joint Otec Nismo project. A Nissan Laurel C34 based wagon was released in September 1996, called the Stagia. It is widely regarded as a compatriot of the Skyline, rather than the Laurel it was based on, owing to drivetrain configurations, commonly AWD using a TCASA common modification on the Stagia is to fit it with an A34 Skyline front in effect making an R34 look-alike wagon. A manual transmission was only available on the RS4 and RS4V models. There was also an Otec tuned Stagia, the 260 RS. Released with full GTR running gear, including an AB26 DETT engine and manual transmission, a unique body kit, 17 inches BBS style alloys, and GTR instrumentation. Models HR33 GTS, 2.0 LRB20 ESOHCI6, 130 picoseconds, 96 kilowatts, 172 nm, ER33 GTS 25-2.5 LRB25 DEDOHC16, 190 picoseconds, 140 kilowatts, 231 nm. ENR33 GTS 4-2.5 LRB25 DEDOHC16, 190 picoseconds, 140 kilowatts, 231 nm, 4WD, ECR33 GTS 25T, 2.5 LRB25 DET DOHC Turbo I6, 250 picoseconds, 184 kilowatts, 294 nm. ECR 33P Rye 280 Type Mister, 2.8 LRB 28 DET DOHC Turbo I6, 300 picoseconds. 1996 The R33 Skyline, Series 2, continued the concepts introduced in the R32. Driver and passenger airbags became standard in 1996. As a result, Pre-1996 models are barred from being imported into various countries for consumer road use as they do not meet the frontal impact standards. For the RB25 DET engine the ignition system was also changed, with the ignition module no longer located on the cam covers and was instead replaced by smart ignition coils, igniter built into coil, and ECU. The RB25 DET turbo was also given a ceramic compressor wheel. Throughout the time the R33 was produced there were quite a number of different styled lights and body kits fitted, the actual body chassis underwent no changes. Among the cosmetic changes in the Series 2 were, the headlights which tapered down more towards the grille and were fitted with improved reflectors, the grille, which was longer on the Series 1, 
the bonnet which had a reshaped leading edge to fit the new lights in front bumper changing shape in the smallest amount to match the lower edge of the new headlights. Later models of the Series 2 also had the option of having an active LSD fitted. The R33 ceased production in February 1998 with the 40th anniversary R33 Series 3. GTR The BCN R33 GTR version also had the same B26 DETT engine that the BNR32 was equipped with, although torque had been improved, due to changes in the turbo compressor aerodynamics, turbo dump pipe, and intercooler. The turbo core changed from a sleeve bearing to a ball bearing, but the turbine itself remained ceramic, except on N1 turbos, steel turbine, sleeve bearing. From the R33 onward, all GTRS received Brembo brakes. In 1995 the GTR received an improved version of the RB26 DETT, the Atisa ETS four-wheel drive system, and Super HICAS four-wheel steering. A limited edition model was created in 1996, called the NISMO 400R, that produced 400 horsepower, 298 kilowatts, from a road-tuned version of Nissan's Le Mans engine. A stronger six-speed G-Track gearbox was used. An F33 GTR driven by Dirk Scheusmann lapped the Nordliff in less than eight minutes. Though it was often said to be the first production car to break eight minutes, the limited run Jaguar XJ220 had already achieved a 746 inches lap. Other manufacturers had caught up since the R32 was released, and the R33 never dominated motorsport to the extent of the R32. Models GTR, 2.6 LRB26 DETT DOHC Twin Turbo I6, 305 picoseconds, 224 kilowatts. 375 Nm, advertised as 280 picoseconds, 4 WD, GTR LM, 2.6 LRB26 DETT DOHC Twin Turbo I6, 305 picoseconds, 224 kilowatts, FR, NISMO 400R, 2.8 LRB XGT2 DOHC Twin Turbo I6, 400 picoseconds, 294 kilowatts, 478 Nm, 4 WD, 4 Dr. GTR Otec version, 2.6 LRB26 DETT DOHC Twin Turbo I6, 305 picoseconds, 224 kilowatts, 375 Nm, advertised as 280 picoseconds, 4 WD, only 447 made. R34 in May 1998, the EN34, HR34, ER34 and BNR34 marked the introduction of the more fuel-efficient and environmentally friendly RB25 DETNEO engine. The RB20E engine was discontinued in the ER34 base model, GT, and the RB20DE, after last being used in the ER32 Skyline, was reintroduced in updated NEO guise. The R34 GT powered by the RB20 DNEO, coupled with a 5-speed gearbox, became the most fuel-efficient straight-six skyline to date, of any shape. The 4-speed automatic transmission available on some models in the previous two shapes were discontinued. In its place, Nissan produced a 4-speed Tiptronic transmission for all of the automatic versions, except the base 2.0L, which has a standard 5-speed gearbox. Only the GTT Coupe variant was sold in New Zealand and Hong Kong from 1997 to 2000 respectively. They were the only two countries besides Japan that sold the R34 GTT model Skylines new. All Japanese Nissan Prince store locations that sold the Skyline were renamed Nissan Red Stage. Models GT, 2.0 LRB20 DE Neo i6, 155 picoseconds. 114 kilowatts, 25 GT, GTX, four-door model, 2.5 LRB 25 DE Neo i6, 200 picoseconds, 147 kilowatts, GTV 2.5 LRB 25 DE Neo i6, 147 kilowatts, GT4, 2.5 LRB 25 DE Neo i6, 200 picoseconds, 
147 kilowatts, 4WD, GTT, 2.5 LRB 25 DET NEO Turbo I6, 280 horsepower, 206 kilowatts, 343 Nm. GTT 1998-2001 Turbo model also available in non-turbo model, GT. Standard features include 2.5 LT NEO 6 engine, limited slip differential, xenon headlights, rear window wiper, driver airbag, front passenger airbag, 17 inches alloy wheels, anti-lock braking system, traction control, front seat belt pretensioners, front seat belt force limiters, rear seat lap sash belt, child seat attachment, side impact protection bars, power windows, central door locking, Steering wheel height adjust, lever steering wheel, alloy wheels and ultraviolet reducing glass. Optional features include front fog lamps, rear fog lamps, front spoiler, rear spoiler, side airbags, navigation system, tinted windows, sunroof. It came in a two-door coupe or a four-door X variant. GTR The GTR reappeared in 1999 with a revised chassis and other updates. The A34 turbos received a ball bearing core. The A34 N1 turbos had a metal exhaust wheel, and ball bearing center section. The turbo outlet pipes were changed from cast of formed metal outlets. The intercooler outlet side and rear turbo dump pipe had temperature probes fitted in the V-Spec models. The biggest feature and most significant feature to the A34 GTR that wasn't seen on any other model Skyline was the display unit at the top of the dashboard. This display unit was very significant for the car at its time. This display showed many of the car's engine stats including boost pressure, oil temp, water temp and more. As a 1999 car this kind of technology was very rare and advanced at the time. The display was capable of showing the g-force that the car was under when driving and there was also a lap timer that could be started by a button that was located near the gear stick. There was a computer jack led hidden underneath the left passenger side skirt that could be used to transfer driving data from the car to a laptop. This could only be done with a Japanese version of Windows and Japanese software, which today is very hard to come by. Other features such as the battery being located under the back seat of the car made more room available in the engine bay. The Nissan Skyline GTR rivals are the Toyota Supra and the Mazda RX-7. Models, all 4WD. GTR, 2.6 LRB 26 DETT Twin Turbo I6, 332 picoseconds, 244 kilowatts, 392 newton meters. Advertised as 276, GTR V spec, additional aero parts, brake ventilation ducts, diffuser, LSD, GTR V spec 2, as above plus carbon fiber hood with NACA duct, GTR N1, blueprinted N1 motor, no AC, no stereo, no rear wiper, basic interior trim. Only 45 made, GTR M spec, leather interior. Softer suspension with ripple control dampers, heated seats, GTR V Spec 2 NUR, as above V Spec 2 plus N1 motor, 300 km per hour speedo. Only 750 made, GTR M Spec NUR, as above M Spec plus N1 motor, 300 km per hour speedo. Only 253 made. GTR Nismo S Tune The S Tune was an M Spec but with further modifications to components in the engine block. GTR Nismo Atune same as the S Tune, the Atune was a different style M spec. GTR Nismo Z Tune, 2.8L, board and stroked, RB26 DETT Z2 Twin Turbo I6, 500 picoseconds, 368 kilowatts, 540 newton meters, Z1 and Z2, only 19 made. Skyline GTR MSPEC 2001 the MSPEC is a version of Nissan Skyline GTR with ripple control shock absorbers, MSPEC specific leather seat, front rear seat, with front seat heater, three spoke leather wrapped steering wheel, and choice of four body colors, including silica breath, RPM multi flex color.
the vehicle went on sale on May 8, 2001. Skyline GTR MSPC NER, VSPC 2nd NER 2002 The MSPEC NER and VSPEC 2 NER are limited, 1000 units, versions of Nissan Skyline GTR with Super Take UN1 spec engine, for Japanese market. It included 300 km per hour speedometer, 3D grade name emblem, and addition body color option, Millennium Jade, metallic. The vehicles went on sale on February 26, 2002. Production The production of Skyline GTR Type 34 ended in August 2002. Since the beginning of Skyline GTR MSPEC NUR and VSPEC 2 NUR sales, 25% of vehicles sold were MSPEC NUR, 75% of vehicles sold were VSPEC 2 NUR. Millennium Jade, White Pearl and white body colors have been used on 28%, 22%, 16% of MSPEC NUR and VSPEC 2 NUR vehicles respectively. Marketing As part of the Type of 34 GTR final campaign, all Skyline GTR customers received a GTR official photo album, Lidai GT Rohu Ishiaru Xiaoit Senjiksi and Ding Ban before January 24, 2002. V35 slash CPV35 The 11th generation, V35, Nissan Skyline, introduced in June 2001, was based on Nissan's FM platform, shared with the Nissan 350Z. The Nissan Skyline used a front midship engine, VQ35D and others as below, rear-wheel drive layout, four-wheel drive was available for the sedan to achieve a 52% per 48% weight distribution. The V35 was the first Skyline made for export to the United States. There it was sold under the company's luxury brand, Infinity as the Infinity G35. The all-new Skyline was introduced at reorganized Nissan Japanese dealerships called Nissan Red Stage in conjunction with the reintroduced Nissan Fair Lady Z, sold exclusively at Nissan Blue Stage Japanese dealerships. The V35 broke with previous Skyline tradition. There was no straight six, no turbo, and no GTR, a decision which extended to all later Skylines. The intention had been for the model to use a different name, a decision reversed by Renault Nissan CEO Carlos Ghosn, who chose to gear the V35 towards the luxury sport market. Billing the 350Z as a pure sports car, Nissan put a slightly more powerful VQ35D in the 350Z, and while the Skyline and the 350Z shared the same platform, the 350Z had additional bracing, underbody aero parts, and weighed 100 kg less. Some fans refer to V35 as the new generation Skyline due to drastic changes between the V35 series and its A34 predecessor. Japanese tuners mostly ignored the V35 Skyline. The 2006 Tsukiba Super Lap Battle had not a single V35 entrant. Tuners such as Mines, Amuse, Hosaka, Garage Defend, M Speed, Najiza, MCR, HKS, and Top Secret continued developing a 32 or 34 GTRS as time attack cars. Top Secret did tune a V35, but replaced the VQ35DE with a VK45DE V8 twin turbo. Signal USA entered a V35 in Formula D, replacing the VQ35DE with an Staradian 20DET. Models 250GT, 2.5L VQ25D DV6, 215 picoseconds, 158 kilowatts, 270 Nm, 250GT4, 2.5L VQ25D DV6, 215 picoseconds. 158 kilowatts, 270 newton meters, 4 WD, 300 GT, 3.0 LVQ 30 D DV6, 260 picoseconds, 191 kilowatts, 324 Nm, 350 GT 8-3.5 LVQ 35 D E V6, 272 picoseconds, 200 kilowatts, 353 Nm. 350 GT Coupe, 
3.5 LVQ 35 DEV6, 280 picoseconds, 206 kilowatts, 363 Nm. XVL Concept 1999 it is a concept car demonstrating the FRL class platform. It includes a 3.0 LV6 direct injection gasoline engine, CVT transmission, sedan body. The vehicle was unveiled in 1999 Tokyo Auto Show. Skyline Sedan 2001-2006 The vehicle went on sale on June 18, June 18, 2001. Early models include 250 GT, 250 GTE, 300 GT. Early Skyline driving helper model includes 250 GT. Beginning in 2002, the Skyline sedan was sold in North America, known as the Infiniti G35. Skyline 250 GT4 sedan 2001-2006 the Skyline 250 GT4 sedan includes a Tessa ETS all-wheel drive with 50-50 synchro mode, VQ25DD, NEOD, engine, 5-speed automatic transmission. The vehicle went on sale on September 26, 2001. Skyline 250 GTM, 350 GT8 sedan 2002-2006. The Skyline 250 GTM sedan went on sale on January 13, 2002, while the Skyline 350 GT8 sedan went on sale on February 19, 2002. 2003 Update Changes to Skyline sedan include Repositioning of the rear car badge and Skyline emblem, refinement of the design of the radiator grille, headlamp inner panels and sills, Addition of sparkling silver metallic and rose red pearl as new body colors for total of six body colors, refinement of the control switch design, adoption of sun visor extensions, addition of a light to the front seat vanity mirrors, adoption of a double pivot rear view mirror, expanded application of rear seat air condition events to the 250 GT and 250 GT4 models, refinement of the suspension and braking system. The Skyline Coupe was introduced as a version of Infiniti G35 Sport Coupe for Japanese market. Early Skyline sedan models include the 250 GTM, 250 GT, Premium, 300 GT, Premium, 350 GT8, 250 GTM4, and 250 GT4, Premium. The Skyline sedan went on sale on January 27, 2003. The Skyline Coupe went on sale on January 16, 2003, automatic, and February 6, February 6, 2003, manual. Early Skyline Coupe models include the 350 GT and 350 GT Premium. Early Skyline sedan and coupe driving helper models include the 250 GT and 350 GT respectively. Skyline 350 GT Sedan 2003 to 2006. The 350 GT is a version of the Infiniti G35 Sport Sedan with a six-speed manual transmission for the Japanese market. The Skyline 350 GT and Skyline 350 GT Premium Sedan went on sale on June 3, 2003. 2004 update. Coupe and sedan changes include. Soft touch material on panels, center stack, automatic transmission shift knob, door armrest grip uses aluminium, tilt and tilt telescope steering wheel, car wing supported TV navigation system, optional, 5 speed automatic transmission includes synchro rev control, 350 GT premium, reduced vibration on 6 speed manual transmission. Sedan changes include front grille bumper, foot panel, headlamp, Rear bumper, rear combination lamp, 17-inch aluminium load wheel are changed, 18-inch aluminium load wheel option for 350 GT8 and 350 GT Premium with manual transmission, new body colors include ink shore blue, metallic, warm silver, titanium metallic, silky ecru, C, black, G, interior color, front seat active headrest, rear middle seat with three-point seat belt as standard. Intelligent key setting, 
engine immobilizer set option in some models, door mirror with heater, air conditioner with left-right independent temperature settings as standard, multi-plate clutch inside a TESA ETS with snow mode is changed to electromagnetic control. Coupe changes include 19-inch aluminium load wheel option, new body color, lakeshore blue, metallic for total of five body colors, sport tuned suspension for 19-inch tire models. Early coupe models include the 350 GT, premium. Early sedan models include the 250 GT, premium, 350 GT premium, 350 GT8, and 250 GT4, premium. The Skyline's 2005 update included changes to the head and rear lamps, front bumper, and side sill protectors. Also, 19-inch aluminium alloy wheel became standard for automatic transmission cars. A new body color, brilliant silver metallic, was added, while seats upholstered in pearl suede and leather became standard. Aluminium trim rings were added to the speakers, and also a plasma cluster ion full air conditioner with left-right independent temperature settings, heated door mirrors, headlamp auto labelizer, compliant with new legislation, were made standard equipment. Early coupe models include the 350 GT, premium. Early sedan models include the 250 GT, Premium, 350 GT Premium, 350 GT8, and 250 GT4, Premium. Production As of July 1, 2001, total Skyline orders reached 4,200 units. V36 slash CV36 per joules 50. Initial release the Skyline sedan went on sale on November 11, 2006, with an update to the Skyline Coupe beginning in fall 2007. Early models included the 250 GT, 250 GT4, and 350 GT. It was first available only as a four-door sedan in Japan and was also sold in the USA as the 2007 Infiniti G35. On May 13, 2008, Nissan announced that a convertible variant of the Infiniti G37, US spec Skyline Coupe, would be produced for the 2009 model year. The convertible is not available in Japan. Skyline 370 GT Coupe DBA CKV36, 2007 Introduced in 2007 for the 2008 model year, it is a Japanese version of the Infiniti G37 Coupe. 18-inch wheels are used on the base and 370 GT Type P cars, while Type S and Type SP cars include 19-inch wheels. The Skyline Coupe went on sale on October 2, 2007. Early models include 370 GT, 370 GT Type P, 370 GT Type S and 370 GT Type SP. 250 GT Sedan DBA V36, DBA and V36. The 250 GT sedan is a Japanese version of the Infiniti G25 sedan. Four-wheel drive is standard on 250 GT4 models, NV36, where N stands for 4WD. The 250 GT Type S was introduced for 2008 model year. 17-inch wheels are standard for all model ranges, except for the 250 GT Type S, which is 18-inch wheels. 350 GT Sedan The 350 GT Sedan is a Japanese version of the Infiniti G35 Sedan. Four-wheel active steering is available in Type S and Type SP as option. 50th Limited 2007-2008 The 50th Limited is an option for Skyline Sedan models 250 GT Type P, 350 GT Type P, 350 GT Type SP, and 250 GT4 Type P, commemorating the 50th anniversary of Nissan Skyline. The interior is marked with anniversary red leather seats, and serial numbered front glass. The vehicle was unveiled in 2007 Tokyo Motor Show. The 50th Limited models, along with 250 GT Type S, went on sale from November 27, 2007 until March 31, 2008. Skyline Coupe Aerosports Concept, 
Skyline Aero Package Concept 2008 Skyline Aero Package Concept is a version of Skyline Sedan 350 GT Type SP with dynamic front and rear spoilers, redesigned sporty front grille and chromed alloy wheels. Skyline Coupe Aero Sports Concept is a version of Skyline Coupe 370 GT Type SP with new exterior and interior looks with new aero parts and seat materials. The vehicles were unveiled in 2008 Tokyo Auto Salon, followed by 2008 Nissan Customized Car Show. Production As of November 28, 2006, sales of the Nissan Skyline sedan reached 4144 units. As of December 18, 2006, sales of the Nissan Skyline sedan reached 6612 units. As of October 16, 2007, sales of the Nissan Skyline Coupe reached 1562 units. Marketing As part of the Nissan Skyline's 50th anniversary, information on Nissan Skyline could be found in the PlayStation 3 version of the Gran Turismo video game. As part of the Nissan Skyline's launch event, a touch and feel, new Skyline event began in Nissan Gallery. As part of the Nissan Skyline's 50th anniversary, a Grand Tour in Japan event took place starting on March 10, 2007. Following the event, the Grand Touring Legend and Future event was staged at Tokyo Midtown, showcasing 12 generations of the Nissan Skyline. The event continued in Nissan Gallery at Ginza with a chance of winning a Skyline postcard. As part of the Nissan Skyline's 50th anniversary, Warner Music Japan published a CD titled Skyline 50th Anniversary CD, featuring music from Nissan Skyline commercials. Skyline model cars had also been produced. As part of the Nissan Skyline Coupe launch, a series of 15 accessories under the Skyline collection label, including wallet, card case, key ring, leather, engine cover, and 370 GT, intelligent key case, zipper lighter, Slyline Coupe T-shirt, grey, Slyline Coupe pins, in vibrant red, brilliant silver, strafia blue, white pearl, super black, fountain blue, and lunar mare silver, went on sale at Nissan online shop beginning October 2007. 2008 Update Sedan changes include Scratch shield body paint for all body color, new body color crystal white pearl, 3 coal pearl, is added for total of 6 color choices, uses Skyline Coupe mirror, aluminium finisher color change, rear middle seat includes adjustable headrest, door lower soft touch material, V6 engine model uses VQ37 VHR engine, 7 speed automatic transmission, intelligent air conditioner as standard equipment, except 250 GT, 250 GT4, active AFS as standard equipment. Curtain airbag, side airbag at front seats as standard equipment. Coupe changes include Scratch shield body paint for all body color, new body color crystal white pearl, three coal pearl, is added for total of seven color choices, walk and level color change, door grip finisher handle change, five speed automatic transmission replaced by seven speed automatic transmission, intelligent air conditioner. Privacy glass as standard equipment. The vehicles went on sale on December 2, 2008. Early sedan models include the 250 GT, 250 GT4, and 370 GT. Early coupe models include the 370 GT. 370 GT sedan DBA KV36. Introduced in 2008 for the 2009 model year. The 370 GT sedan is a Japanese version of the Infiniti G37 sedan. It replaced the 350 GT sedan. 18-inch wheels are standard for all model ranges, except for the 370 GT Type P, which has 17-inch wheels. Skyline crossover DBA J50, DBA and J50. Introduced in 2009, it is based on the Infiniti EX37, for Japan market. The vehicle was unveiled at Nissan Gallery's Nationwide beginning on April 18, 2009, 
and later with all seven body color variants at Nissan Galleries. Sales of the Skyline crossover began on July 13, 2009. Early models include the 370 GT, Type P, and 370 GT4, Type P. Four-wheel drive is standard on 370 GT4 models. 18-inch wheels are standard for all model ranges. Transmissions 2010 Update Skyline Sedan, Coupe 2010 Changes include 7-speed automatic transmission option for two-wheel drive Skyline Sedan with the 2.5-liter V6 engine, Skyline Sedan 250 GT Type P, 250 GT Type B, 250 GT4 Type P, 250 GT4 Type B, 250 GT4 and 250 GTA package models receive appearance enhancements designed to create a sharper, more masculine look. In front are a new grille, bumper and headlamps. The fog lights are moved down to the bumper, previously, the fog lights were integrated into the headlights, offering a more aggressive feel. The rear bumper has also been redesigned and there is also a new 17-inch aluminum alloy wheel design. Skyline Sedan Sport versions, 370 GT Type SP, 370 GT Type SP, 250 GT Type S, receive a special wider, low-centered body design for a more dynamic, sporty appeal. Changes include a new unique grille, front bumper, headlights, rear bumper and use of black trim for the inner headlamp panels. Skyline Sedan body color choice is expanded to six, including new dark metal gray, metallic, and vibrant red, solid. The center console trim has been redesigned to express greater volume, AT models only, with the center armrest reshaped for better integration with the console. New soft materials are utilized for the console sides and cup holder lid and there are new patterns and shades for the genuine aluminum and genuine wood trim. The Skyline sedan adds modified beige and black interior color treatments. Enhancements to the instrument panel include white illumination for the vehicle information display and instrument indicator, as well as standardized lettering for speedometer and tachometer. The intelligent cruise control system now works between 0 and about 100 km per hour, not available with sedan 250 GTA package. A manufacturer option for Coupe 370 GT Type P and 370 GT. Both sedan and coupe come with the HDD Carwings navigation system, which now offers enhanced entertainment features, including a built-in digital terrestrial broadcast tuner and USB connections for iPod and other music playback devices, offered on all models except the sedan 250 GTA package and coupe 370 GTA package. An upgraded intelligent air conditioning system is also standard on all models except the sedan 250 GT and 250 GTA package and coupe 370 GTA package. The revised Skyline sedan and coupe went on sale on January 6, 2010. Skyline Coupe, Crossover 2010 Coupe changes include Wheel design change, new body color shining blue, pearl metallic, for total of seven colors. Crossover changes include New body colors ceramic blue, metallic, dark metal gray, metallic, frambois red, two coat pearl, for total of six colors. The revised Skyline sedan and crossover went on sale on November 15, 2010. Skyline 55th Limited Edition 2011 to 2013. The sedan version of 55th Limited is a limited, 555 units, edition of Skyline sedan commemorating 55th anniversary of Nissan Skyline. Changes include anniversary red leather seats with front seat heater, 55th anniversary embroidering at front seats, black interior color, and garnet black, pearl, body color. Sedan version, covering the 250 GT Type P, 250 GT4 Type P, and 370 GT Type SP, went on sale between December 19, 2011 and April 30, 2013 for Y equals 3,990,000, Y equals 4,221,000, and Y equals 4,515,000, respectively. The coupe version is a limited, 55 units, 
edition of Skyline 370 GT Coupe, commemorating 55th anniversary of Nissan Skyline. Changes are the same as the 55th limited edition Skyline sedan. The coupe version, covering 370 GT Type P and 370 GT Type SP, went on sale between February 10, 2012 and April 30, 2013. A customized version of Skyline sedan, with high intensity LEDs and S tune items, wide, low center of gravity optional parts, was unveiled in 2012 Tokyo Auto Salon. Skyline Crossover 2012 Changes include, intelligent cruise control, lane departure prevention, lane departure warning, forward collision warning, front seat emergency brake sensing pre-crash seatbelt, intelligent brake assist, steering wheel switches, audio navigation, voice command, hands-free phone, intelligent cruise control, lane departure prevention, become standard equipment. The revised Skyline crossover, covering 370 GT, Type P, and 370 GT4, Type P, went on sale on October 25, 2012. Marketing Nissan Motor Company, Limited and Minami Kanto Regional Office, Japan Post Network Company, Limited announced the sales of original frame stamps titled History of Cars Nissan, Skyline, 5,000 units, and History of Cars Nissan, Electric Vehicles, 1,000 units. The designs of these original frame stamps are based on Nissan's successive Skylines and Electric Vehicles. The frame stamps went on sale from February 1 to August 31, 2010. King Records published Nissan Skyline CM Collection, featuring a compilation of Nissan Skyline commercials. As part of 55th anniversary of Nissan Skyline, a draw of 500 Skyline meets EIZIN Suzuki 2013 calendars took place in December 2012. HV37 Skyline Sedan 2014 The design was based on Infiniti Q50 sedan, with Infiniti logo emblem at front grille. Other major changes were the debut of the electric petrol hybrid powertrain in the range and the discontinuation of petrol-only models. Japan model was set to go on sale in February 2014. Early models include 350 GT Hybrid, 350 GT Hybrid Type P, 350 GT Hybrid Type SP, 350 GT4 Hybrid, 350 GT4 Hybrid Type P, 350 GT4 Hybrid Type SP. Engines 350 GT4 hybrid models include a TISA ETS four-wheel drive system. Production Skyline sedan was built in Tokiji plant, Kamino Kawamaki, Kawachi-gun, Tokiji prefecture. Marketing The Skyline sedan was targeted towards males at the age of 40s. 